You are watching an educational film by Johnny Cosmetics. Today I'm going to demonstrate a green frosty lid with natural tones to smoke out the crease and corner. I'm also using peachy tones to brighten up her cheeks and her peachy lip gloss. Enjoy! This is Butter Pecan Super Cream Eyeshadow. It's water resistant and crease resistant. I'm blending it in from her lash line up to her brow bone. It acts really nicely as a base for your powder shadows. It makes them last all day. Now I'm taking Bewitched Frost Shadow and I'm patting it on from her lash line up to her crease. It's a frostier shadow and it just looks really pretty on her eyelid. Now I'm going in with Sienna Matte Eyeshadow and I'm buffing it into her crease. I'm using her eyeball as a ruler and I'm using a real fluffy brush to do that. Back and forth. Looks fun. Now I'm wiggling in a little bit of Coffee Matte Eyeshadow on the outer corner of the eye going back and forth into like a sideways V shape. Don't be afraid to stick that brush in their crease. You gotta work it, girl. Work it. Now I'm taking Black Magic Matte Eyeshadow and I'm wiggling it inside of the coffee to make sure that it's a deeper fade. So you really can't see where it begins or where it ends. I'm taking Sienna Matte Eyeshadow again and I am buffing it into her brow with a flat angled brush. Now I'm taking Forest Powder Liner and I'm rimming her top waterline and I'm gonna rim her bottom waterline. It is a smooth application pencil, special edition. Doesn't have any beeswax or wax substances in it, so it prevents from running down your face. Now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna take Coal Powder Liner and I'm gonna rub it into her lash line to finish off the eyeshadow look. I'm using her lashes as a ruler. Now I'm taking High Definition Black Mascara in Carbon and I'm rubbing it into her lashes. It's a small wand, so it really gets a grip of those lashes and smaller particles so you don't get as clumping. I'm taking Liquid Mineral Foundation SPF 15 and I'm buffing it into her skin. It get, dries down to a nice soft satin finish. Taking Invisible Blot Powder and it looks like I'm beating her face with it, but I'm actually setting the makeup. It doesn't need setting, but I set it for the video because I'm gonna apply a bronzer in front of it. Now I'm taking Mineral Bronze Duo in Brazilian Bronze and I'm buffing it into the parts where the sun would naturally lay on her face. That sounds awkward. Going in, blending, blending, blending. I'm putting on the side of her forehead, cheeks, nose, jawline, and chin, and I'm buffing it in. As you can tell, if you look at natural skin, you'll see that we have three to four different colors to the skin anyways, so we gotta give that color back. Now I'm taking Flirt Mineral Matte Shadow and I'm buffing it into her cheekbone. Underneath her eyes, I'm gonna highlight it with matte eyeshadow and cream. This is like a little nap in an eyeshadow. I am taking Hush Automatic Lip Pencil and I'm coloring in her whole lip with it, laying it down as a nice foundation, plus, it really makes the lip color wear super long. Taking in Mocha Lipstick and rubbing it into her lips, along with Desire Liquid Luster Lip Gloss to finish it off. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to comment. Go to johnnycosmetics.com and register to win free products. You will like them. And uh, have a good day. Bye.